did Jesus curse the fig tree? It wasn't the season for figs. I don't know. I still don't know. The fig tree couldn't help it. Not having any figs. Not having any figs. <laughs> How could the fig tree have known that Jesus was going to pass by? And even if it had... Even if it had, what could it have done? Not be in the season. Not being the season for figs. It was a fig tree. All he could do was wait. Wait until the season and in the season make figs. Bless it. <laughs> but he didn't bless it. He cursed it. Are you sure? And on the morrow, when they were come out from Bethany, he hungered and spied a fig tree far off having leaves, and went to see whether he might find anything thereon. But when he came there too, he found nothing but leaves, for the season of figs was not yet. And Jesus answered and said to it, Never man eat fruit of thee hereafter while the world standeth. And his disciples heard him. Mark chapter 11. And you believe it? I do. More to the point, why are you always asking me? I moved here six days ago, and now you've asked me three times. Because I'm that fig tree. First, that fig tree existed 2,000 years ago. Second, you're not a fig tree. I've been nothing else ever than that fig tree since the war. Not since they came home. Who? The prisoners of war. My husband. My first husband. What? But he was dead. Brought back his body, and that were rare. He came home, but I was told he was dead. I got a telegram. Then a letter from his commanding officer, Major Townsend. A good letter, kind, and I've still got that letter. He was killed officially somewhere near Cologne, between Arkham and Cologne. He lost a leg. He was left for dead. But a German doctor saved his life. But he couldn't save his leg. His leg was smashed. And on the 3rd of June, 1945, he came back to Bermondsey on crutches, without a word before. So, why are you cursed like that fig tree? We were dancers. Dancing was our life. Go on. How could he dance with one leg? And I found somebody else. Men <laughs> died quickly then, and I was in a hurry. And I needed to dance. And you 
you need them out to dance. I tried to go back to him. <laughs> and it was a botched resurrection. <laughs> but I wanted to. But I ran away. Where? Here, Hastings. I've never been back. He died. Cancer. 1950. Never went to his grave. Scared. But a, a miracle was asked of me, and I could not. Like that fig tree, I couldn't respond. Not at that season of my life. Think of it more and more and more as if 1945 was getting closer. And I'm getting closer to death. And he's there waiting. My husband on crutches. Forgiveness. For me? You're more than a fig tree. Even one of those two thieves was forgiven, even as he were crucified. But you're not Jesus. <laughs> I am. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. As much as you're a fig tree, representative thereof. I ran away too. A priest. I must have the face of a priest. People confess. I can forgive you. He can. I've been a bastard. Times a bastard. <laughs> <laughs>